what's up guys welcome back to another trip to the thrift if you guys are enjoying the videos hit that like button it lets me know help the channel grow drop a comment and subscribe if you're not already and let's go see what we can find this week the only thing i found in the store so far is the kentucky jersey the nike elite size medium for 3.99 number four check out this little guy i found because bff plush for 3.99 and then i also found the puma dortmund jersey <laughs> size small for 3.99 Got the Real Madrid jersey, 2018 size small, unfortunately, but $8.99. Good price on that one. Seems legit. This S15 drift car is actually pretty cool. It sucks because he's never had the remote, the controls that go to them. If it had the control, I definitely would have grabbed it for $8.99. So I found this Unisanus T, which is a, or was a YouTube channel. I don't think they exist anymore. Or as I remember him as the guy that beat up Leonhardt at the Creator Clash. <laughs> They want $5.99, but this shirt actually has some decent value to it. I'm assuming just because the channel's not around anymore. Got the Birdhouse tee for $1.99. I actually might hold on to this one and wear it. This Bruce Lee tee is actually pretty cool for $1.99 size XL. I found this tee. I didn't know what it was. I just like the graphic. Hello out there. It's like an alien cat. Then on the back, you have Michelle Malone, SBS Records. So I guess it's like an album from 2001. It's two bucks size XL. Yikes. They got two of my favorite things, Persona 5, an actual official tee. They do want six bucks for it. And then you got that back hit, the Take Your Heart. And then my favorite anime of all time, the Yu Hakusho tee. And that one's five bucks. The best Disney animated film of all time, in my opinion. I found this Eevee plush for $2.99. I wish it was anybody else but Eevee or Pikachu. Like, they make so much stuff of them. It's really hard to move that stuff. I'm grabbing this one for personal wear. Huge fan of Phil Collins. And it's from 2019, Welcome so it's probably not worth that much anyway. I found this Lacuna Coil Delirium tee. I just thought it was pretty cool. Size XL for $4.99. The Disneyland Paris tee. Size large for $4.99. Still pretty clean too. Found the Lowrider tee for $3.99. He's got the logo right there on the front. And that's an official one on the Lowrider tag. And then the Minnesota Twins Cool Base jersey for $3.99. Size XL. Unfortunately, nobody on the back, but four bucks. I found the Blazendary tea. <laughs> Whatever happened to this kid? Is he still making content? Don't you hate when you see something from afar and then you get close and realize it's too good to be true? Well, that's happened to me. First off, we have a pair of fake Black Cat 4s, which these would have been great. But it doesn't end there because you come down more. And a pair of the white and red 4s too. <laughs> Both super fake. So that blows. But I did find this pair of 990s for $15. I found this Wolfenstein RPG game tee. But you guys know I like my video game tees for $1.99 size XL on the Beefy Haynes tag. And on the back you have the EA ID logo. Here's this I'm a Chocolate Nut Vintage tee on the Haynes tag. $1.99 size large. Mouthful of chocolate, M&M hand, chocolate covered nuts. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there's more in the back. I didn't even realize that. This FC Cincinnati jersey from 2019. Unfortunately, it's like covered in these like really light stains. I don't even know if it's going to come up in the camera. And they went $8.99 for that one. Got a pair of these cement tins, or I thought I did, but I guess they're fake. Like I didn't even know they made fakes of these. The style code comes up, the steel tins from 05. So that's funny. But I did find a Lapras for three bucks. An official Lapras. You guys have no idea how many fake Pokemon plushes I see all the time now. Found a pair of Doc Martin boots in a men's size 10, 20 bucks. Never a bad grab when you find them. I found this Detective Pikachu hat. Um, I can't find it nowhere online. They want four bucks for it. It's an official Detective Pikachu hat, but it's like a movie promo only in theaters. And I tried looking it up online and I can't find it, but for four bucks, I guess I can take the gamble on it. All right, guys, that's gonna bring us to the end of this week's trip to the thrift. I hope you guys did enjoy the video. Hit that like button, drop a comment, subscribe, all the YouTube stuff, and I will see you guys soon with another one later.